Sacktown, what's happening? Sacktown Pete back at it again. Today, I want to talk about Chris Duarte. I am actually excited for Duarte to see him in a Kings uniform. I think this is going to be the most overrated, underrated pay, uh, pickup by Monty McNair and staff this offseason. And it's going to be, it's part, it's actually my favorite offseason pickup at all the offseason pickups that the Kings have done this season. Um, Duarte comes over from the Indiana Pacers. Uh, and I think he's going to play with the, a big chip on his shoulders this upcoming season. Uh, he's a guard. We gave up only two second round future second round draft picks for him. And I think he's going to be really, really worth it and pay off dividends for the Sacramento Kings. Um, just another weapon to have off the bench and to implement in the best offense in the league history coming off a historic season. And let's take a look at some of his highlights and study his moves. As you can see, he was a teammate of DeMontis Sabonis in Indiana with the Pacers. And you can just see he, he can do everything, man. He can pull up. He's got the shot, the pick and roll game. Look at the tough step back here over the defender and just goes in. He could put the ball on the on the on the bat in the, in the hoop as well. Look at that fadeaway turnaround right there, and he can put the, he can dribble the ball as well, guys. I think there's another tough turnaround right there. I think this is going to be really really a good pickup. And look at the range, man. I mean, you cannot have enough shooters with range, and he's got range. Um, he was hurt most of the year last year and just didn't couldn't find minutes. And I think that. It's going to be refreshing for him to come in off the bench with Davion Mitchell, with Malik Monk, and be a force with those two off the bench. I mean, uh, the talent is insane. Spot up and shoot. He can pretty much do everything. And I think the connection with Domanis Abonis as well. I think it's going to be you know, rejuvenating to see him be with Domas again and pair up with Domas because, let's face it, when you're with Domanis Abonis or you're familiar with Domanis Abonis' game, you can move without the ball. Domas is going to find you. And you can see here on the fast break, there's Domas right there in the highlight right there. That leads to a, a one-handed jam by uh, Duarte. And there he is setting a Duarte screen. And look at that. Spots up a wide open three. Makes it in. Nothing but the bottom of the net. Here he is with the pump fake. Drives into midi. He's got a mid-range game too. Um, he's pretty much automatic from the mid from the midi, man. And just he can hit tough step back shots. He can create his own shot. And that's why I love Duarte. He can actually just, when it's tough, he can actually get his own shot off, man. And I think that's going to pay off dividends be so valuable to the Kings for the Kings off the bench, and especially in Mike Brown's system. Here he is in transition, pulling up right there for the three. Um, a hard, hard, uh, tough shot right there. It goes to the rack and gets it. And look at the range. Clock going down, beats the buzzer. Um, he's got the range, man. He's got the range. I'm actually excited. I want to hear from you guys. Let me know your guys' thoughts on Chris Duarte. And for those of you that don't know, uh, not much we're aware of Duarte. I can tell you, he's a big time player. This game right here, I remember this game when he in his rookie year, he torched the Kings. I was actually at this game and I was just shaking my head the whole time, like, yo, who is this guy? This guy is the real deal. And the fact that I was very familiar of him coming out of Oregon and even just this game in particular, man, he torched us a new one in this game, guys. Um, he was. Really lights out. And look at his freedom of movement without the basketball. Cutting right there to the hoop for a dunk. Um, I'm excited, man. I'm thrilled. I'm excited about Chris Duarte. I want to hear from you guys, though. Let me know your guys' thoughts on Chris Duarte and how do you see him fitting in with the Sacramento Kings. That's actually going to do it for me for today's video. I really do greatly appreciate you guys tuning in. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. Please hit the like and subscribe. I'll greatly appreciate it. And I will catch you guys in my next video. And, um, Smash that like button and subscribe to this channel. So stay tuned. Keep it locked in. That's going to be for today's video. I will see you guys in the next video. Take care. God bless. Keep pushing forward. And we will see you guys in the next video.